<laughs> okay, so I'm Zoli, um, and I'm one half of a two sister team behind Be Fab Be Creative Digital Fabric Print Studio. Um, I'm a curator, a designer, a facilitator, and a doer of many things. I'm also not a big fan of public speaking, so I'd like you to think that I'm imagining you all a little bit as naked as this guy here. I'm not sure if you can see him. Um, but he's actually here to illustrate the fact that we uh, print photo quality designs onto a range of natural fabrics in the heart of Leith in Edinburgh. We set out the business because, having been made redundant back in September 2011, um, Zoe, having had her daughter, um, neither of us really knew what we wanted to do when we grew up. Could you tell from the first slide? <laughs> um, so, um, I decided to get some of my own work printed um, whilst trying to work this out and discovered there seemed to be a bit of a problem with the digital print industry. Um, it wasn't very friendly um, and we couldn't really find anybody to do what we wanted them to do and they didn't really seem to want to print um, fabric for people like me. I just wanted to print a metre here this month and maybe another next month and see how it went. So, <coughs> having come from a retail background, having worked for Habitat um, for over 10 years, um, I was completely baffled as well by the fact that this wasn't a really simple transaction. Surely as a designer, I send my designs to you um, and pay for my fabric and you send me printed fabric back. Yeah? No, it wasn't this simple. So, because we both have this desire to um, improve process and a little bit of a reckless attitude that we can pretty much do anything we put our minds to, for the record, it's quite hard, but we didn't find that out until um, the printer arrived. <laughs> so we had to just suck it up and go on with it. Um, so we want to make the process simpler for designers and possibly even enjoyable. So that's what we're trying to do. Um, we count ourselves very lucky that we get to work with these incredibly talented designers. We get to work with people both at the very start of their career as well as more established businesses. Um, but it's the small bespoke print orders that we really enjoy working with. Because to be perfectly honest, printing 20 metres of fabric well, think of a cat watching the tennis all day. That's kind of us with the printer. So, we build relationships, our clients with our clients. We really give a damn about the fabric that we send out. Because having um, been on the other side of the process, we understand that these aren't small transactions that you guys are making. We know how much blood, sweat and tears has gone into um, your designs, and we want to make sure that we represent that to the best of our abilities. So, um, however, it doesn't matter how much research you do when you set up your own business. Um, the thing that you think you know, you don't, and they'll always be challenged. We set up about six. Um, we spent about six months initially calibrating the printer, and uh, her name's Bertha, by the way. Um, and to make sure the colours were spot on, only to find out the software that the industry tends to sell to us people um, who print it doesn't really like accurate. So, after a rather interesting conversation with our now amazing Dutch suppliers um, on the difference between nice and accurate colour, um, and a conversation about how Santa's outfit might once have been green, but it definitely shouldn't be orange when we ask for red, um, we found out that most printers have to manually change all the colours in the designs to match what they think the designer's colour is looking for. Seems a bit mad. We thought so. And it wasn't going to be good enough for BFAB. So, um, a lot more investment in some pretty high spec software and we're kind of proud that we can say that our colours are both nice and accurate. Unless you don't want nice and then we can just do accurate, it's totally up to you. Um, and because of all this hard work that we put into reproducing our clients' designs, we get to feel a little like Santa too. Because we turn something on your screen into real life fabric that pops through your door. Um, at which point, our clients seem to forget that they've paid for this and they just think that we send them beautiful little fabric parcels. Um, we've even been described on Twitter as the fairy godmothers of fabric printing. Um, and by hang, um, helping our designers build their dreams and their businesses, we get to build our own too. And to be perfectly honest, that's pretty freaking awesome. Really doesn't get much better than that. Um, the other thing that we love to do <coughs> is promote the amazingly talented people that we work with. We always knew that we set up business, um, BFAB, that this was something that we wanted to expand on as a business. So last summer, we set to work on Printed & Co. We were aware that there was a gap in the market for um, designers to sell their uh, fabric without um, massive outlay or um, simply having to sell or license their work. 
So having come to come Having come from this background, we think it's incredibly important to have as few links in the chain from designer to, um, to client as possible. This way we can retain the passion, integrity and story behind the work. All of our designers have soul and we think it's really important to get this across as much as the designs themselves. So we, at Prince Deco, we created a, it's a curated collection of some of BFAB's most talented designers. This is one of them. Susan is here tonight. She's going to hate me for that. Um, she also took all the good photos you see tonight. <clears throat> um, so, what we've done is create a, an online home for them to promote and sell their fabric designs directly, sold by the meter and on our fabrics, including silks, cottons, linens, and bamboo. And this was launched in February this year at a three week long exhibition um, at the Colopsia Gallery in Ocean Terminal where not only did we have our 10 Prince to Go designers and their wares, we had a further 25 designers and makers from all over the world um, just promoting and showcasing the work that, exciting work that fabric designers are doing at the moment. So, whilst we are a digital fabric print studio, and that's what we do in love, we're not just a digital fabric print studio. We promote and we encourage the work of all of our designers to because if we're doing well, then so, if you're doing well, <laughs> so are we. 